Can we use the coffee ground as plant soil? Coffee grounds are a standard waste product, but did you know they can actually be used as plant soil? Coffee grounds are rich in nitrogen and other nutrients that plants need to thrive, making them an excellent addition to any garden. However, a few things to remember when using coffee grounds as plant soil. For example, coffee grounds can make the soil too acidic for some plants, so it's essential to use them sparingly. You also want to use something other than fresh coffee grounds, as they can stunt the growth of seedlings. Using them as plant soil is an excellent option if you're looking for a way to recycle your coffee grounds. Just be sure to research first to ensure it's the right solution for your garden. Growing plants is becoming more and more popular with people. This has led to many different contraptions being made to help the plants grow better and be more accessible for their caretaker to grow. One question that often comes up is, can we use coffee ground as plant soil? Can we use coffee ground as plant soil? Many people ask if they can use coffee ground as plant soil. This article will cover the benefits and dangers of using coffee ground as plant soil. Yes, coffee grounds can be used as plant soil. Coffee grounds can be used as plant soil, but they should be used in moderation. Too much coffee ground can make the soil too acidic for plants. Coffee grounds can also be used as mulch or compost. Coffee grounds are an excellent soil amendment for gardens. They can improve drainage and aeration while providing nutrients like nitrogen, phosphorus, and potassium. Plus, coffee grounds can help to increase the population of beneficial microbes in the soil. There are a few things to remember when using coffee grounds as plant soil. First, ensure the grounds are arid before adding them to the earth. Wet coffee grounds can compact and become anaerobic, harming plant roots. Second, mixing coffee grounds with other soil or amendments is best. This will help to ensure that plants get the nutrients they need and that the coffee doesn't end up as a weed-suppressing mulch layer on top of the soil. If you have access to used coffee ground as plant soil, give them a try in your garden. However, it is essential to consider pH levels and the type of plants you plan to grow. If you want to add some nutrients to your garden soil, consider using coffee grounds as a natural fertilizer. Coffee grounds are rich in nitrogen and other minerals that can be beneficial for plants. However, it is essential to consider pH levels and the type of plants you plan to grow when using coffee grounds as plant soil. Coffee grounds have a high acidity level, so they are best suited for plants that thrive in acidic conditions. If you're growing plants that prefer neutral or alkaline soils, you'll need to adjust the pH level of the coffee grounds before adding them to your garden. You can mix the coffee grounds with an equal amount of compost or garden soil. It's also important to know that not all plants benefit from the added nitrogen in coffee grounds. Nitrogen-loving plants, such as tomatoes and peppers, will thrive when fertilized with coffee grounds. However, other plants, such as most flowers, actually require less nitrogen than what's found in coffee grounds. Too much nitrogen in the soil can lead to stunted growth and yellowing leaves. If you need to figure out how your plants will react to coffee grounds, it's best to start with small amounts and see how they respond. 
the best time to apply coffee grounds is before planting seeds or transplants. Coffee grounds can be a great addition to your garden soil, but it's essential to know when to apply them. The best time to add coffee grounds to your soil is correct before you plant seeds or transplants. This will give the coffee grounds time to break down and provide nutrients for your plants. Thank you for watching coffeeeternal.com